haya bila shaka upo vizuri sana popote pale ambapo unatazama Chill na Sky. Uh, karibu tena kwenye kipindi hiki ambacho nakukutanisha na watu ambao wakati mwingine unawaona tu lakini haujui mambo mengi zaidi ya ndani katika kazi unazozifanya. Mimi naitwa Frederick Bundala Skywalker na hii ni Klaus Plus. Unaipata pia show hii kupitia simulizi na sauti SNS. Na leo nimepata bahati sana kukutana na kaka yetu uh, legendary katika masuala ya uongozaji wa video za aina mbalimbali matangazo muziki filamu uh, series na vitu vingine amekuiva kweli kweli na huyu ni kaka wa directors wengi sana wa hapa nyumbani Tanzania anaitwa Adam Juma lakini pia unaweza kumita AJ mara ya mwisho kuonana na Adam ilikuwa kama miaka minne mi, au mitatu iliyopita mm-hmm. na ilikuwa ni katika mazungumzo tu ya uh, kishikaji na kupata nyama choma na nini na tulipokuwa tunazungumza pale ulikuwa unazungumzia uh, kuja na series fulani unaona mm-hmm. kipindi kile pia ulikuwa na uko uh, base sana na masuala ya label yako ya muziki mm-hmm. ambayo sasa hivi naona kama vile si siki tena i hope mm-hmm. uta, utazungumza mengi zaidi ya hayo yeah. lakini of course kuna muda ukapotea na sasa hivi naanza kuona tena uh, kupotea kwa maana kwamba Adam tuko na mfahamu zaidi katika kuongoza video za muziki lakini najua kazi zingine ziko zinaendelea matangazo na uh, kazi ambazo sio lazima tuzione sio mm-hmm. lakini hivi karibuni kuna video kama Mario uh, ambao nimeiona nimeona pia video ya Kasim Mganga mm-hmm. kwa maana yake ni kwamba pengine Adam Juma he's back lakini mm-hmm. tutaongea mengi zaidi katika hayo Adam <laughs> karibu sana asante sana nashukuru uh, uh, asante yeah, yeah, uh, wanasema like you never left ama <laughs> kuondoka kabisa <laughs> uh, i don't know uh, unajua kwenye tasnia yetu yeah especially eneo hili la la upiga picha mm. um watu na, haondokagi kwenye kitu wanachokifanya yeah. especially kama unakipenda hiyo kitu Uh, if you're an artist first then it's not a problem mm. and you you you'll do it till you like your 70s or 80s mm. you you can be on a wheelchair like you unaweza kuwa unafanya kazi kwa sababu kazi yetu sisi ni ni sana uh, ya picha mm. lakini ni sana ya hadithi so kusema kweli siwezi kusema nimeondoka unaweza kupumzika mm-hmm. lakini kuondoka that's a that's a difference kuna watu wanaondoka na mkuondoka oh yeah, yeah. yeah but yeah lakini okay, wewe well, huku ni ngumu kuondoka yes i think yeah. ni ngumu kusema kwamba bwana muondoka labda umepumzika mm-hmm. unajua unapofanya kazi kwa muda mrefu sana mm. uh, inafika sehemu kwamba akili yenyewe kwanza either inachoka okay unaona so unahitaji kufanya kitu tofauti yeah uh, na nataka kufanya kitu tofauti inawezekana ukafanya kitu kingine tofauti kabisa okay. especially kama ukiwa kwenye creative industry mm-hmm. Um a lot of what wengi sana they they move in Africa same as so now they reach a point they want to do something different mm-hmm. eh? okay and i i feel so uh, pia goals katika maisha zinabadilika ah uh, you have other goals or you have other ones and wishes so mm. that happened to me okay um pia na reasons i have a lot of reasons um unajua si wengine tunaofanya vitu kama music video ni tofauti sana na watu ambao wanafanya music video sasa hivi. Mm. Sisi tulivyoanza uh, madhumuni yetu yalikuwa tofauti kidogo. Um, ha, kama mimi sikuanza music video to be a star. Mm. No, no. Oh, for that matter just kutengeneza zote muziki. I had a purpose and one of the purpose nilikuwa um, my countryman. Yaani watu ambao wananizunguka na wafanya nao kazi. Um, yes kuna kipato unapata na wao wanapata lakini watu walikuzunguka uh, ile circle ya, ya watu walikuzunguka maana kwa wao they have to be successful pia mm. um, kwa hiyo na ilikuwa ni sort of like nafanya music video kuna upande mmoja tunapata lakini tunarudisha kwa watu unaona kama mnakumbuka vizuri almost tangu naanza uswazi there was no profit unaona lakini kuna haja ya kuwa na certain balance mm. eh kuna unaweza kukuta kuna mziki wa aina moja tu wa kuburudisha tu lakini kuna itajika mziki wa elimu unaona eh ambao utawasaidia watu unajua watu hawajui reach ya mziki ikoje mtu anaweza kaa na mawazo ikamsaidia kumliwaza 
anaweza kawa na changamoto ikamsaidia kupata uh, kufumbua shida yake anaweza kawa na ugonjwa wa moyo katika mapenzi na mziki kumsaidia kuelewa japo ikampa fununu kwamba ah, tatizo kumbe limetoka hivi kumbe naweza ngapata solution kwa mimi tangu nimeanza uh, jumbe zangu nyingi sana ni kujaribu kumsaidia mtu kwa njia ya picha kuelewa kwamba ah, kumbe sio lazima niishie hapa okay. naona na pia hapo hapo uh, watu wengi tunaofanya nao kazi we very close to them maana kiatufanyi tu kazi tu labda video imeisha baada hapo muondoka naona we very close to baadhi ya wasanii eh to a point tunajua tuna, ta hiyo maisha yangu tunavyoishi eh, familia yangu mm. unaona kuna wengine ambao tunawahudumia na sio kuhudumia fedha tu lakini hata ushauri wanapokuwa na matatizo okay. wanakupigia saa saa za usiku saa saa usiku that relationship ku small cool uzuka yacha tu hivi hivi okay. um, ku kwa hiyo mara nyingine ukiona mtu anasema anaacha labda kuna sababu inampush okay. haja hii kutokea hata mtu mmoja kuniuliza kwa nini niliacha mm. mimi incident ya na hii ni because some of the people wanafanya nao kazi anakuja inaanza kama ni biashara lakini baadaye inakuwa mwana mm. kwamba you work with them and then <coughs> kama i've worked with nuru for years yeah yeah oh, no, no, mm. but have I've stayed with Nuru like up baka saa tisa tunakaa tuna chill tunaongea mm. you know no one really understands our relationship me na Nuru ikoje you know what I mean like how, how do we work yeah. you understand mm. no one cared to ask but it's not just Nuru mm. watu kama kina ngwea mara mgwea yeah yeah you know we're buddies we talk and antumia ngoma unajisikia i'm like yo this is a good song oh it's a bad song it's a terrible song we study over you know what i mean You know I I have this problem bro what do I do mm. you know some people call me like hey man kuna msichana hapa she's pregnant I don't even know what to do I'm like dude relax <laughs> yeah. so that level mtokisha kupa that respect yes as a brother yeah and then vitu vina happen I remember niko kwenye msiba wa ngwea and it was very devastating kwangu mm. like humana you know uh, two weeks ago alintumia nyimbo Mm. And I'm like this is a dope song. I'm going to work on it. Mm. Ah brother sina kitu. I'm like no problem. Ngoja mimi nimaliza vitu vyangu mwenyewe nina commitment nikiwa sawa we'll do it. Mm. Kwa sababu nataka nifanye vizuri na heshima yako nini. And then two weeks later actually nimpangia mpaka siko ku shoot. Oh. And then he didn't show up. And then a couple of days later and then niko niko South Africa. I'm like dude uko South Africa. Mm. Wakati umepanga mpaka kila kitu everything is is like unajua nini kuna vitu naika sawa nikirudi we'll talk. Mm. And when that happened that was really upsetting. Yeah, yeah. Wakati uko njiani na pifa tunaenda Dodoma and then Langa is checking me. Mm-hmm. He's like yo Adam vipi na kuaje nini 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 we got to do something about you know kuna ngoma blah 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 I'm like all right cool haina shida ngoja ni dude and then that happened yeah, yeah. and i'm like man what's going on mm. so you just the back story kills you you're like you know what ebu ngoja ni let me just go do other things okay kwa hiyo and na mimi na na background moja kubwa sana with a lot of a lot of big influential people ni mafanya fanya kazi nyuma kuna siku moja walikuja watu watatu big caliber i won't say why ina gani yeah yeah and they asked me why are you doing music videos because you have a big religion background oh, i yeah. said yeah okay well yeah it's true mm. i quit in a, sort of a big background of religion but in life some people do the wrong things for the right reasons mm. and some people do the wrong, right things for the wrong reasons nyio watatu hapo mimi najua wote mnachepuka yeah Najua yani mpaka mnachepuka na nani ninajua. Eh. Wakashtuka kama eh kama unataka ni watajie majina na kila nani tena sio mtu mmoja mnachepuka eh. na Saidi watu wawili watatu. Eh. Sasa mimi kwa Saidi ya vijana eh hiyo kwa hiyo wasio vibaka. Eh. <laughs> kwa ngumi mimi nyinyi ndio mmeona tatizo kubwa sana kiasi cha kama mmenitengeneza kikao bia kuniona. <laughs> Sio maneno. Okay. So I might do I might be doing the wrong things maybe for the right reasons. Okay. Una, una. And kweli we I can I can if I ni kitom kono wangu I have I have been successful not competing na pesa nyingi because that's not how I quantify things. Mm-hmm. Una, una. I'm very happy nikiona watu ambao some of the managers they call themselves managers today. Mm. Tuliwasaidia garent. Yeah. <laughs> Wakati tuna matatizo, rent proper kabisa. Bora mimi nimefukuzwa nyumbani. Hey. Brother, point over. Mimi sina kitu lakini, yani hey. sio mimi msenigani. So 
kuna sehemu and mm. this applies also kwa marehem ruge mungu amweka mahali pema yeah, yeah, yeah. uh, ruge ame alijitengenezea mazingira lakini kwa sababu ya kudeal na wasanii kuna picha fulani ilitengenezwa mbaya mm-hmm. na hakuna mtu ambaye anaweza kuielezea vizuri eh ulikuwa ukifuata marehem ruge Bwana mimi bwana shida bwana mimi nafukuzwa nyumba apartment atakaa tangaika wi eh. atakutafutia milioni 4 milioni 3 yes atakulipia mm. utakuwa comfortable mm. ikifika mda wa show inabidi ukati ule milioni 4 yako eh umesahau kuambia management eh na sisi jamani naonea okay sasa nakuonea hivi wakati mkusaidia katika ile hela yako sure wewe ndo atakukata kidogo kidogo unaona kama unaonewa umeona mm. sasa ndo kazi ya sanaa ilivyo hivyo okay. unajua there is there's a lot of challenges even when label eh people used to stay in my house mm mkao kwa nauliza what is going on now asani wana kibizana huku umeniliwa you like i'm like don't worry about them they, they will be okay you know they're part of as a cc as as people in the industry mm. we cannot stop yeah we can't stop and we can't really stop me i was very upset when livwacha watu wengi hawajui nilikuwa nafanya kitu gani mm. nakumbuka 2014 hiyo si ndio tulitangaza eh 2013 2014 yeah. lakini you know what happened yeah. 2014 mm. nimeenda mburahati nikakutana na vijana aitwa waswazi yeah. ndio nilipokutana na aba process okay eh tukamtengenezea studio aba tukampa vifaa vikorokoro vyote mm. ndio aba wa leo huyo okay sijui umeelewa mm. tukasitengeneza studio pale kina mario ndo akawa na record pale kina darasa walikuwa wanaenda ku record kwa aba huko huko brati mm. so it doesn't stop kama wewe ni binadamu you have the heart or you have the ability kusaidia watu people will always remember you okay they don't have to mention your name mm. lakini i believe uh, in the quest of being a better human being mm. kwa binadamu bora eh tuna haja ya ku, kuweza kuwasaidia wengine hata kama wanatuumiza eh? it hurt me very much eh? mtu kama mtu kama and this is the first time i'm talking openly yeah because it's out of my heart i don't have to hold grudges anymore eh. yani sio lazima nianze kuifikiria kwa baya yes eh unafanyia mtu kazi miaka miwili mitatu chakula iko kwa ndakao mpe mwanao lakini unakikata kidogo mm. unampa msanii yeah. unaona yeah. lakini mwisho siku hashukuru mm. unapokuwa kijana na kuuzi lakini baadaye unakuja kuona ah kumbe ni ujana tu. Inawezekana hata wewe ukushukuru watu wengine. Yeah. Una, so unaona ah unasamehe tu. Mm. Lakini unapomsaidia msanii alafu hao ni atoe ile tashukurani. Mm. Inaumiza sana kwenye sana. Exactly nani No I mean just like we, 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 tulikuwa na engagement we did 18 na jelly okay. and in the middle way mtu aka I don't know what happened yeah, yeah. and then someone walked away and yeah. you don't know what the problem was mm-hmm. kwa sababu watu walikuwa nakaa nao kwenye nyumba moja you were sharing they were using mm-hmm. your resources so it, it comes back to the question of the label yeah. umaona so these things they always happen lakini unaanza kuelewa kwamba ah one ni ujana umeelewa but this is also another thing it's not just me mm-hmm. mimi an artist I'm an artist Let's say look at the situation at Diamond Ali Kiba. Mm. Kuna watu wengi nyuma wanafuata and they're pumping the beef. Mm. You understand? Lakini hao watu wamefanya wanafanya jitihada. No matter what happens, wanafanya jitihada. Mziki alipopeleka Diamond mm. pakubwa. Yeah. People should appreciate that. End of the story. Yeah. No drama. Yeah. Anapopeleka Ali Kiba, people should appreciate. They're two different people, mm. but you should just appreciate. Yeah. yeah. Lakini afika sehemu maneno atamuingia kichwani. Mm. They be like you know what no way. I'm going to go to Zanzibar. Nitakaa tu kwenye sofa. My YouTube is going to give me money yeah. and no more music. Yeah. Then what happens after that? What happens? What's the story after that? Yeah. No one has a plan. Tuna plan ya kuongea na kuchaz. But we do not really 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 talk or even appreciate some of the people who are pushing this country in the frontier. Mhm. Mon, angalia yeah. tasnia ya filamu. I think I was also among the few people ambao walikuwa I didn't appreciate Kanumba that much. Mm. Yes, but after some point of time okay. I really appreciated mm. him. After Alvofarik and I regretted like I really was like oh my goodness huyu jamaa he's just too big he's mm. just too big and it, it, it's scary kwamba hakuna mtu atakuja ku watakuja watu obviously mbele lakini yeah. kupiga hatua ile umeelewa yeah. mimi nachukia sana mtu akinilinganisha na mtu mwingine yote. Yes. Kwa sababu mimi kwa katika muda ambao wajabu mno 
Ya ni muda wa ajabu ambao huwezi hata kumfananisha mtu yoyote mm. katika huo muda huo. Katika msimu mm. Mapigano ambayo tulipigana sisi sio ya kawaida. Sure. Sio neno. Yani yeah. I am a person that I used to I'm a programmer. Umeelewa? I love to do computer ndo, ndo shughuli zangu. Kwa hiyo ile 3D yote mnaona ni utundo. Zingo shule no nothing. Yeah, Sio umeelewa? Yeah, yeah. Alafu niko siku moja mamangu anakuja ananitembelea ananikuta niko juu ya forklift. Uh-huh. Nimetengeneza kiti kimeko kwenye forklift ili kiti kiende juu chini. Yeah. Nipata shot ya crane. Mm. Niko kwenye kiti forklift ina juu chini. Mimi ndo nimekidesign kiti. Nimekeka na ukiangalia tena hiyo hiyo video ni chungwa. Chungwa ya Somalia. Ya Somalia ile yeah. shoot ya kwenda juu chini. Eh. Yeah. Yaani ime shoot ni kwenye forklift. I say. Mtu huyo mmoja. Eh. Yeah. Sasa how how is it that you you take 10 years of struggle mm. and then uju uringanishi. Uh, 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 yeah, this, yeah, this. Yeah, it's not fair. So what I did is walk a mile so that other people mm. can actually keep on walking. Yes. Do you understand? Yeah. What Ali Kiba Diamond and everyone else is doing is walking that mile mm. so that watu wengine waje ku it, it becomes easier for everyone else okay. and someone has to do it at one point and they don't have to brag about it hata kikuliongelea hata kiku lakini nafikiri sasa you have to do it kwa sababu watu wengine hawaelewi wewe ulikuwa upo kwa ajili gani upo kwa ajili gani sio umeelewa so i don't i na ngiangalia na angalia watu wengi sana kuna vitu wanavifanya hivyo ambavyo wanasahaulika kabisa tuongee kuhusu damu na kiba kwa sababu mm. umefanya video na karibu kila msanii mkubwa mm. wadogo wa katikati mm. sikumbuki si nani msanii mkubwa ambaye hujafanya naye kazi yes. na miongoni mwa watu ambao touch yako uh, video zako umezifanya nyingi sana za damu platinums yeah. na of course kuna muda akaanza kwenda uh, South Africa alianza kwenda Kenya kwa Luka mm. waogopa then uh, uh, nini good father na kwingine So kuna wakati hapa alipoacha kufanya kazi unajua watu wataongea lazima mm. yes watu wakawa nasema labda kuna kama ugomvi kati yenu wawili mm. what is the true story nini ambacho kilitokea okay. uh, honestly mimi sina ugomvi na diamond okay we sijai kuwa na ugomvi na diamond mm. and among the people um, niki, nikisema nichukua wasanii maybe wa tano yeah kwa hiyo industry ambayo naheshimu diamond na naheshimu sure sure Sio mm. maana in fact na niamekia mara zote I'm like dude <laughs> take this <easy. laughs> so and it's always very cool yeah cool I've never had really a problem na Raymond yeah lakini I think kuna kuna confusion ilishatokea okay ambayo ilikuwa ni party ya management mm. I don't think yeye mwenyewe alijua hili uh-huh. if you watches this interview probably anaweza kaelewa okay that one person in the management mm. kuna kitu alitakiwa kunifanyia okay and then he messed up <laughs> Sio mnaelewa. Kwa hiyo ile hela ilipokuja alikaa mbraza mimi nakata hapa. Kwa sababu una hela yangu. Okay. Kwa hiyo akaenda huko agageuza geuza 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 mpaka kesho unajua ile tatizo lipo. Okay. Mnaelewa. Kwa sababu ujamaa kiburi and I'm like no problem. Lakini watu wote wenye industry wananijua. Okay. I don't care who you are. If you have what is mine. Yeah. Ambacho nimekifanya kazi brother na kukata. Yaani kabisa yaani sina sijui maneno sio kwamba eti labda unaweza kusema hii ni jeuri hapana sio jeuri yeah. ndio nilivyo yaani hata kama ni shilingi 3000 yeah. kama tumekubaliana na shilingi 3000 marehemu ndio ilikuwa hivyo naruga tu kwa hivyo yaani ajali asipoli 5000 atalalamika mimi akaya utuma na damu za mlai kwa la brother nilipe 3000 yangu analipa tunaendelea umeona hasa issue ilikuwa hivyo kwa sababu bwana huyu mtu kapewa kazi kapewa hela kiasi fulani kaenda kafanya kuna uhuni ukafanyika mm. siko akajifanya tu bwana kuna advance hapa ya video like advance ya video eh. baza advance ya video afmini na kudai ya raia hapa eh. tulia kwanza eh. kwa hiyo advance mimi nikaila kwanza nikamwambia okay. <laughs> sababu tumepunguza ah baza kufanya hivyo nikamwambia sasa wewe labda ukawaambia vizuri kawaeleza huko kwenye management yenu kwamba bora ungemtuma mtu mwingine lakini eh. wewe umeileta wewe eh. ah bifu ndio ikaanzi hapo i say ikawa kubwa i'm like ah So mimi end of the day kwa sababu ukweli na ujua. Yes. Alafu kuna mtu mwingine unajua. Hii tusiyeke mbaya sana. Yeah. Mtu anasema ah, bila sisi hatuwezi kutoka. Mm. Au wewe hauwezi kufanya nini? Come on. Mm. Not this world. You might be a big star today. Mm. But you have to understand at one point of time kwa jinsi dunia ilivyotengenezwa 
at point, point of time utashuka utaenda utakuwa you will be normal yeah. you have to be ready ki psychology mm. to be ready to be to, to 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 play normal and be okay yeah. and that's the thing most stars on us are we kwamba you know cuz when you're on your prime you're on your prime Come on, let's look at what Kibao can a little win. Yeah. There's a year little win I think as I'm featuring the heart back you like Atari, Atari. This guy will never be you understand? Yeah. Where is he? I'm like 50. Yeah. 50 did it for like 4 years. We were like so I'm like to when this yes yeah. and then una jaribu kwa sababu binadamu jinsi walivyo na walivyoombwa ni kwamba hata sikiliza kitu fulani masikio atachoka. Yes. Eh? Atapenda kitu fulani movie fulani baada muda fulani ataona cha kawaida. Ndio alivyo lakini sasa tuna utayari mm-hmm. lakini kuna ile kasomba mtu imeletwa kabisa na naambiwa mpaka mimi ofisini unajua watu flani sipokushika wewe i'm like for real okay i'm just not doing videos eh hey. si you know yeah. ngoja nifanye kitu flani mm-hmm. i've been teaching mimi yeah tuna nipigia simu burundi nenda nafundisha okay eh hey, anipigia simu ethiopia kuna siku nimefika ethiopia i remember yani nimefika pale mimi tuna mabegi hey. Asa na juuliza haya magari haya si kumbe magari yamekuja kuchukua bibi ah yeah. <laughs> that's like okay the guy ndo karatasi kashika okay hi hi mr juma yeah. mr juma i'm like yeah, yeah. I'm mr juma what's up mm. asa tunaingia kwenye i'm like man maybe go wa wamekosea alama yeah. kuna mr juma mwingine <laughs> sio wewe eh yeah, sio mimi yeah. basi kamtumia mtu ile message kampigia bwana bwana akambe no no they are drivers ah uh, you know cuz this is the first time that we're going to shoot a video That's going to go on channel O. Ko serikali imeona ichangie itakupa hoteli na sema ukare kaso. I say. That's a country of Africa. Hey, Diamond is a star yeah. across Africa. Yes. If any country today you tell them this is the guy that did 10 videos of Diamond or Kwanza mm. that made him who he is. Yeah. Unafikiri nje itakuachia? Um you get my point. Yes, yes. Kwa hiyo I can go anywhere and work anywhere mm. but I choose to stay in this country. One kwa sababu naipenda nchi mm-hmm. eh nataka watu wetu wasogee yani raia ndugu zangu tusogee zaidi eh tupate zaidi eh tuweze ku, kuvuna zaidi na kwenye bara letu la Afrika tuongoze mm-hmm. umeelewa okay. tuongoze tuwe na heshima wewe tumefanya kazi kubwa sana kwa hiyo ile kasumba kwamba ah mimi king Adam Juma yeah. mambo mambo ujana yeah. na kama kuna mtu nimemkosea kwa upande wa, wa mziki ujana mm-hmm. naomba msamaha okay. kwa sababu mara nyingine ni ujana tu sure. na mimi wengi ambao wengi ukiona kuna watu wengine tumeshakosiana unakuja unashangana fanya naye kazi mm-hmm. eh tuli, tuli tupiana maneno mazito 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 na kina Linux mm-hmm. siku akatafuta akawa naogopa kama blaza <laughs> Mimi sasa hivi mimi na kama uko tayari kufanya kazi za mimi unajua I see na shida. Kwa hiyo kuna kwenye part of I think part of growth is forgiveness. Okay. Ukiweza kumsamehe mtu, ukaweza kuangalia mapungufu yako na kwake, um ni kuweza kumleza mpasogea kikubwa na furahia unachokifanya. Okay. I mean be, uh, uh, diamond anachokifanya uh, na furahia na pendoza na juhudi zake. Mm. So kama kuna matatizo then au ni matatizo tu madogo kwa binadamu pia kimenadamu sawa sawa hii ni chill na sky mgeni wangu ni Adam Juma AJ uh, tunapata mapumziko mafupi tunarejea kuna mengi sana ambayo bado hatujazungumza na Adam so stick around